What's going on guys? Stein back with another video and in today's video I'm talking about you working out every single day for the rest of your life. I had a video on this, another earlier video on this that I made a couple months ago and that one got the most views on my channel so I, I thought I'd expand on it with another video like today's video just so I can go a little bit more in depth and come after what the people and the people are you, what the people want because that video got the most views on my channel. So, work out every single day for the rest. Let's, I'm gonna even expand on this. Work out twice every single day for the rest of your life. Now, for those two workouts, I like to do one weight training workout and one cardio workout. Or I'll do one cardio workout and one jumping workout, jump rope workout. Or I'll do one, or I'll do two cardio workouts. So I'll do two cardio sessions for both my workouts. And the reason why I do that is because I want two separate workouts for 45 minutes each. I follow the philosophy of 75 hard. If you haven't heard of that, I highly recommend you check it out on the podcast that Andy Priscilla does. And this is a philosophy that I follow that I, that I must work out twice every single day for the rest of my life. And it doesn't matter if it's as simple as going on a 45 minute walk because that 45 minute walk has power, that that 45 minute walk does something to you. You know, when you just go outside in nature, you see sunlight, you see vitamin D and you just get a walk, you get something out of your life, you get something out of, uh, it's something different than you, you know, being trapped like inside, especially if it's cold out or whatever, like even if it's cold out, go outside in the freezing cold, like, just get outside, like get in nature. Nature is very, very important. Everyone needs to get in nature every single day. And, you know, regardless of the situations, that's why Andy Purcell's program 75 Heart is so amazing because it doesn't matter. Go outside and go work out outside when it's hot, when it's raining. Go outside when it's snowing. Go outside when it's super hot. Go outside when it's super cold. It doesn't matter the weather. Go outside and work out because going outside, working out, it does something to you. Going on a walk or a run, it really just does something to you. Now, if you have physical limitations, like you're you know, injured or of that or some sort, then I get it because you know you have to do something like elliptical or, or some other form, but most of you are healthy and most of you should get healthier, go to a doctor, go to someone who can fix you if you simply do the right actions on a consistent basis. So, train with weights, train with cardio, two workouts. Train with cardio, both workouts, two workouts. Do jump rope for one workout. Sometimes I do boxing for another workout, 45 minutes. It has to be 45 minutes, no exceptions. It can be 44 minutes, it has to be 45 minutes or longer. Usually it's anywhere from 45 minutes to an hour and a half every single day both my workouts and the reason for this is discipline and that's the number one killer pillar for success one well, number one pillar to achieve everything you want in life is discipline so and I know that I know what kind of physique that I want in life and that's why I take this so seriously so if you want a certain physique if you want to stop being fat if you want to stop being lazy I would highly recommend the program 75 hard by Andy Priscilla. Very, very important program that you can easily implement into your life that will transform your mindset and it'll transform your everything in your life. Mindset's the biggest thing is because like, you know, you always get those days where you don't want to work out, you don't want to squat, you don't want to go under that squat rack. I had a day like that today. I didn't want to go under the squat rack, but I did it. And you force yourself to, to do the uncomfortable tasks. You force yourself to to do things that are consistently not in proportion to what you want to do. Because in life, as Andy Priscilla says, there's always gonna be doing you're always gonna have to do things in life that you don't want to do. That's just that's just life. That's just the way it is. You have to do things you don't want to do. So it's important that you you discipline yourself to work out every single day, even if it's as simple as going on a 45 minute walk. Like I do that for some of my workouts. You know, if if it's been, you know, I'm ex exhausted, I'm tired, 
something like that or just go on a 45 minute walk that simple walk will do wonders for you because it'll just change your whole outlook on your whole rest of your day um <clears throat> and the beautiful thing about you know 75 hard and, and working out and reading and all this stuff that you have to do drinking a gallon of water a day following a diet no cheat meals no alcohol is it forces you to to just put in work and you're not thinking about having a beer you're not thinking about doing anything that's unproductive or that's undisciplined to your lifestyle so everything you do must have discipline everything you do must have a specific purpose a specific reason why you're doing it and working out just it sets up it sets really just a whole demeanor for the rest of your day if you wake up and you immediately work out first thing you do in the morning is you wake up and you work out it sets a tone for the rest of your day it's amazing that what it does for your life it's amazing what it does for your body is amazing like but the, you know the crazy thing is is like what are you doing if you're not working out like i just i just think that's absolutely astonishing how people will say that they're too busy to work out which makes no sense like what are you actually doing though like what are you busy with like are you an entrepreneur making more than six figures like do 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 dialed in every single day of every single hour that you don't have an hour of your day two hours of your day one workout for not even that an hour and a half because four to five minutes each is an hour and a half so like do you not have an hour and a half every day to implement cardio to implement weight training to implement boxing to do jump rope to do jumping jacks to do push-ups it doesn't have to be with weights like just do something move your body go for a walk go for a run go jogging go do boxing go swim anything to move your body anything that, that counts as a workout you know what to work out you know what's not work out and you need to discipline yourself in this way every single fashion every every single day of your life it will set a tone for your life and it'll set a standard that you won't live any other way like i know that for a fact is that you know i'm not living any other way like i'm gonna work out twice a day every single day until the day i die there's no other way that i'm gonna live because i know that that's the standard i set for myself you have to have rules for yourself you have to have, to have a discipline regimen to how you're gonna do things and why you're doing things a specific way. The reason why I do this is because it's for my mental. Like I just said, if I'm not working out, what am I actually doing? What am I doing with my time? What am I really doing with my time? Because my time is very, very important to me. So it's important that I spend my time wisely and that I'm doing things that are actually productive, that are helping other people, that I'm providing value to other people or, or other people are providing value to me. Life is a value exchange. You work out, you provide value. Other people work out, they provide value. I mean, look at like fitness icons. They are basically like they set an image for what the ideal body should look like. Like what, you know, what counts as like, you know, living in a, like a body. Like what should a body actually look like? Should it look like this? Should it look like this? They set a standard for for what it should look like. And, you know, that's why it's important to, to look at those and feel inspired, feel motivated to actually like, take control of your own life and do things on a specific eat a specific way drink two gallons of water a day never have any cheap meals and work out twice a day every single day for the rest of your life if you just followed a stricture disciplined lifestyle you never have any cheap meals you do everything you're supposed to do every single day you do as much as possible as much as you can as, as often as you can every day by never cheating yourself literally never cheat yourself because you know you feel like crap when you cheat yourself i know because you know i've done it you've done it we have all done it and when you cheat yourself you don't feel good about yourself that's why <clears throat> living that's why andrew tate says living a disciplined lifestyle is an amazing existence because when you don't cheat yourself and you do as much as you can as often as you can and you do and you and you do your absolute best there's nothing that can't stop you there is there's it's a never-ending road of of constant amazing life because you always have something to look forward to you know i'm going to do this i'm going to do this and it's never just a boring you know trend of partying and drinking and just wasting time i just i, I don't like that lifestyle and this is a lifestyle i choose to live if you <clears throat> i highly recommend you follow it to 
to actually like learn about yourself and learn about like you know what actually makes you happy other than drugs or alcohol because that's what makes 99% of the world happy so I hope you learned something from this video and you work out twice a day every single day for 45 minutes with one workout being outside and I highly recommend you listen to the podcast 75 hard by Andy Priscilla so you learn more about the program that he developed to integrate mental toughness into yourself that's a video I have for you if you like the video like the video, comment in the comment section, subscribe, turn your post notifications on, and we'll see you in the next video.